Welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches. I'm Fred Woods, ready to teach. Welcome to Mr. Woods Teaches Math Fluency. It's a new series that I'll be taking you through. We're going to start out by recognizing numbers and counting, visually recognize number amounts, how to count one more, how to count two more, and small doubles. So first we're going to count objects here. So we have one candy, one, two candies, one, two, three candies, and then one, two, three, four. You can continue teaching your student all the way up to five to begin with, and then go on up to ten after that. To get them to start writing, you know, I highly recommend you know, getting something to where they can trace down. So I'm going to say there's one, I'm using a highlighter, two, three, and four. So once I've created the numbers using a highlighter, I'm going to go back and I'm going to use a pen. And I want to have like this pen and I want to go here and, and I want them to trace over those numbers. Now, and they're going to go outside the lines, they're going to do their best. It's not so much the, the exact shape. We want them to get it, an idea because they're just learning how to write this, these numbers. We want them to get familiar with having this number sense of one is equal to one object, two is equal to two objects, three is equal to three objects, and four and so forth is equal to that number of objects. Next up, we want to introduce where you have a number plus one. So it could be one plus one is two. Two items here. And we want to show that two plus one other item is equal to three. Now, initially, you don't necessarily want to have these symbols, you know, a plus symbol and equals and such, but we can count it up. We say three, and you add one, that is four. Then we come down here, let's count. One, two, three, four, plus one more tree is five. We're going to get to the you know, having the addition, subtraction, and other symbols, mathematical symbols, later. But first we want to get them to count. One, two, three, four. Adding one more is five. And they can use their fingers for that too. Now this is a little bit more complicated because we're having a number and we're going to add two more. So up here we have two tigers and we add two more. Now we want them to count on their fingers. So Or they can just count out loud. One, two, three, four. And then write the number over here. We have three, one, two, three, and adding two more, four. And then here's one, two, three, four candies. And if I give you two more candies, we're going to have two more. So we can go back and count one, two, three, four, or count on. So we have four, five, six. Now we're getting into doubles. So these are small doubles. You can go from uh, one all the way up to five. And those are, those are considered your small doubles because we have, for beginning mathematicians, we're going to have it like 10 and less. And then when we get into it a little bit more where they have a mastery of these small doubles, we can take it up to 10 to 20. Initially, we're going to have two candies, and I'm going to give you two more. So how many is that? We can, again, we can teach them to count on. So you have two, three, four. Three candies, three red candies, and James gives you three more. How many do you have? Again, they can count from the beginning. One, two, three, four, five, six to add those three others. Or count on as they get a little bit more number sense in there. So three, four, five, six. And similar for the trees. One, two, three, four trees. And four others grow nearby. So how many trees are in there all? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, or go back four. Now you have four more, so five, six, seven, eight. There are eight trees. Remember, to be a math person, all you have to be is a person that does math. Like, share, and subscribe to Mr. Woods Teaches. Up next, we're going to be talking about small doubles plus one, combinations of ten, ten and some more, and twenty and some more.